D3S is a type of HID bulb that came to the market a few years ago that's supposed to be more eco-friendly. They don't use any mercury inside the bulb and they operate at a different voltage. For this test, we used nine different D3S HID bulbs commonly found on the market and we tested them on a 2018 Dodge Durango. These results are pretty accurate, but results may vary with different headlights or vehicles that you do your testing on. The way we did the test is we pulled the vehicle in at 25 feet, we fired up the headlights, and then we measured maximum lux at the brightest point of the beam with a digital lux meter. These lux readings don't mean anything outside this test. We're gonna use the original D3S bulbs from Osram as the benchmark, and our lux readings will tell us how much brighter or less bright the different options are from stock. First, we're gonna talk about the original D3S bulbs that came in the Durango. These are the OEM Zenarc 66340 HBI D3S bulbs in a 4650K color. I found them online for 100 bucks a pair. You're probably double that at your dealer. On low beam, these came in at 800 maximum lux, and high beam was 1320 max lux. When I'm driving my Durango, I see that the low beam and the high beam are both pretty good. If we can get more light than this out of any of these options, we'll be in good shape. The Osram Zenarc 66340 CBI Cool Blue HID bulbs come in at $165 a pair. The maximum lux on low beam was only 720, but the high beam went up to 1580. The Osram Zenarc 66340 Nightbreaker Laser HID bulbs come in at $210 a pair. Low beam is an intense 1310 maximum lux, as bright as the OEM high beam. And high beam is 1610 max lux. These Nightbreaker laser bulbs are easily the brightest and best pick out of the bunch. The 5500K Morimoto XB D3S bulbs come in at $75 a pair. Low beam max lux was 740, almost as bright as your stock bulbs, and high beam was 770 max lux. The HID warehouse bulbs are the common brand that you can find on Amazon for $33 a pair. We measure these at 320 maximum lux on low beam, and 950 maximum lux on high beam. The Xenon Depot D3S 5000K HID bulbs come in at $139 a pair. We measured them at 630 maximum lux on low beam and 920 maximum lux on high beam. The Philips 42403 XV2 Extreme Vision comes in at $250 a pair. In this test, we measured them at 700 maximum lux for low beam and 1,390 maximum lux for high beam. The Philips 42403 WHV2 White Vision Gen 2 D3S at 5,000K color comes in at $215 a pair. Low beam measures 580 max lux in this test and high beam is 1,410 maximum lux at 25 feet. The Osram Zenarc 66340 CBB 7000K Cool Blue comes in at $260 a pair. Low beam is 810 max lux, and high beam came in at 1,410 max lux. So depending on what you're looking for in a D3S HID bulb, you do have a few good options. There's some that are really inexpensive. There's some that are more blue colored, and then you've got some that are the brightest. The two best options in terms of brightness alone in our test with the Dodge Durango was number one, the Osram Nightbreaker Laser, and number two, the Osram Zenarc Cool Blue Boost. These are the only two that were brighter than the stock headlights, in the Dodge Durango. This is 1500 bucks worth of HID bulbs on the table, and we got them all here so that you could know without having to waste your money. 
If you want to see other aftermarket lighting reviews, comparisons, and install videos, subscribe to our channel so you don't miss what we come up with next. You can find all of these products for sale at our website, www.headlightrevolution.com.